CNN Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrials trading up 100. You get the NASDAQ down 70. S&P's a flat. Gold. Gold contract up $17.60, trading at $17.48 an ounce. We have silver up six cents, $18.78 an ounce. Light sweet crude flat, $96.80 a barrel. Notes and bonds. That's where the action is out here, folks. You get the 10-year note trading up a point at 119.27. The 30-year up a full point plus 21 ticks at 142. You have the 10-year right now. Trading at 2.79 yield. We had a high of 3.47. So you get some action here, man, in a big way. Uh, King dollar. King dollar finally broke. Well, it didn't break. What it did is this. It's down 565, 106.345. And you can see what's happening. We, we're going to continue to have volatility all day long here. But if that King dollar stays low, let, let's pull this up so you can see how this shakes out because your probability goes much higher now that you're gonna get follow through if in fact this king dollar can stay down where it is to the close out here today. The number that it's under right now is the 106,792. You're under that by 400 ticks, okay? That says it wants to go to the bottom of that range, 106, but it gets better, folks, okay? Well, if you're a bull, it gets better, and this is what it is. What you have here is that it is coming right into the trend line from the upswing going all the way back to uh, May 30th. If we break this, let's, let's pitch it next week. If you break this with conviction next week, guess what, man? That dollar is gonna go down to 101, and that's gonna be quite a move, man. And what that will do is that'll continue to give relief to the S&P. We have the gold contract. The gold contract is saying, hey, man, this thing's gonna go. Uh, so <laughs> for Friday uh, in the marketplace, that gold actually can be up. It's pretty cool. And the gold equities, they're up big. If we go take a look at the 10-year, what's happening with the 10-year, this can end, very well could end up being an ABC structure on the way up. And you're talking about deviant, man. It's about as deviant as you can get. So we take a look at this 10-year. It's going after the, the highs that were generated out here of uh, 12016. We hit 12011. Uh, we had volume there of 1.6 million contracts. Well, we're going to have more than that. We're, so now we're pushing into that high with volume. If we break this and it's an ABC structure up, you got some monster action here, man. And that's just going to twist markets left and right. Pretty wild, man. There's no doubt about it. Recap out here. We get the Dow Industrials up 90. NASDAQ is down 72. S&P's a flat. Stay right there, folks. Come right back.